And uh, the way that she works, not just as an actor, but also as a producer, even if she's not technically producing the project, she's... supportive of, uh, of all of her peers. Um, I felt it acutely. Uh, she's shown it's just it's really fun. It's with a great cast. It's with Orlando Bloom and Nick Muhammad and um, and we play improv comedy actors who basically are down and out on their luck and they get an offer to do kind of low level sting operations with the police and to go undercover but because the um, the mantra of improv is yes and <laughs> they get themselves into more and more and more trouble. She's um, the managing director of Flinley Craddock, for, and we're a, a box making company. It's very sexy. So it's it's like it's it has it's so I don't know how to describe it, but when I worked, walked onto the set, it is a hundred percent. It just felt like the office, and but it's also absolutely Australian, and it's absolutely our version of it. But it has all the the echoes that make it the office. And just one more just straight ahead. Amazing actresses and producers and directors. It, it, it made me feel part of a big family. And um... rispetto alla serie madre racconterà uh, un'Italia che non è stata mai raccontata veramente neanche in Italia. Uh, siamo a Milano nel 2030, quindi in un futuro abbastanza prossimo, uh, tutto molto lontano dai soliti cliché, dagli stereotipi italiani um, e nonostante sia veramente una serie d'azione, che insomma per la quale mi sono preparata benissimo, è, 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 diciamo, è la storia che della liberazione di una ragazza, quindi insomma eh, spero che, 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 che il core emotivo della serie venga fuori. Well, it's pretty significant. We made a real commitment a few years ago, just not on anything, you know, that we had to check boxes on, but just the idea that we wanted to be the destination for women all over the world to come to Prime Video to see the very best series and movies and have it be their own personal addiction. And 
that was speaking from a customer perspective, given the female leadership at the company and Kelly Day and I kind of running things on the international and US and global studio side, really feeling like there was a need for it. And so we've given everybody kind of a taste today of what's to come, but it's really been in the works for a few years. So it's, it's pretty exciting for us because I think it'll really feel like a sea change on the originals that we're launching. Mentor was Don Steele. She was the person who gave me Don Steele. Don Steele was my mentor. Uh, just to make sure that they are the protagonists of the story, or the antagonists, but that they are not somebody's girlfriend or somebody's mother. And then season two, you knew that everybody loved it. So season three, how is that? Um, it's good. I mean, it's different.